St. Berthold of Mount Carmel. St. Berthold of Mount Carmel, also known as Berthold of Calabria, was a significant figure in the early history of the Carmelite order. Born in the 12th century, Berthold's life is shrouded in legend and historical accounts, making it challenging to separate fact from fiction. Berthold was born in Limoges, France, around the year 1130. He hailed from a noble family, but felt a calling to a life of religious devotion from a young age. Inspired by the ascetic ideals of the Desert Fathers and the monastic tradition of St. Benedict, Berthold embarked on a pilgrimage to the Holy Land, seeking a deeper connection with God. Upon arriving in the Holy Land, Berthold made his way to Mount Carmel, a place already associated with hermits and monastic communities since ancient times. Legend has it that Berthold encountered a group of hermits living on Mount Carmel who were following in the footsteps of the prophet Elijah. Impressed by their way of life and spiritual fervor, Berthold decided to join them and embrace their ascetic lifestyle. Berthold's presence on Mount Carmel marked the beginning of the Carmelite order as a formal religious community. He is often credited with organizing the hermits into a cohesive community and establishing the foundation for what would later become the Carmelite monastic tradition. Under Berthold's guidance, the hermits adopted a rule of life inspired by the teachings of the Desert Fathers, emphasizing solitude, prayer, and manual labor. One of the defining characteristics of Berthold's spirituality was his devotion to the Virgin Mary. He fostered a deep Marian spirituality among the Carmelites, encouraging them to honor Mary as their spiritual mother and to seek her intercession in their lives. This devotion to Mary would become a central aspect of Carmelite spirituality and remains so to this day. Berthold's reputation for holiness and wisdom spread far and wide, attracting disciples and devotees to Mount Carmel. He became known as a spiritual father and guide, offering counsel and encouragement to those who sought his wisdom. Many stories and miracles are attributed to him, although separating fact from legend can be challenging due to the lack of contemporary documentation. Despite his renown, Berthold remained humble and dedicated to a life of prayer and contemplation. He shunned worldly acclaim and possessions, preferring instead to focus on his relationship with God and his commitment to the Carmelite way of life. His example inspired many to embrace the monastic vocation and pursue lives of holiness and service. Berthold's exact date of death is uncertain, but it is believed to have occurred in the late 12th century. His legacy, however, lives on in the Carmelite order, which continues to follow the spiritual traditions he helped to establish. Today, St. Berthold is venerated as one of the early leaders and founders of the Carmelite order, revered for his holiness, wisdom, and devotion to God and the Virgin Mary.